Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how to count a number of cell in Microsoft Excel. So we have three different formula. So the first count, the second count if, and the third count if with S. What are the, what are the different? Okay, it is the definition count just to count the number of cells that are number. Okay, I will explain you in the real test to show you for the practice. Count if to count the number of cells that meet a criteria. It is like just one criteria. Count S, uh, sorry, count if with S to count the number of cells that meet one or more criteria. It is the point you can see. One or more criteria. It's one only one criteria. Okay, let me show you in the real practice to see how it's different. Okay, let me open one Microsoft Excel. You can see. I already prepare the formula of the and I just delete and show you for example the word count the formula here okay you can see I select count and select a whole column F you can see the result is 18 you can see in here 18 right we can check in here count when we select it's auto count and also some also in here and also have the average you can see in here so so in here we it count any number in here so if we change from f to e mean column e it's not count because it is not a number mean the value of the set is not a number so as the definition the set that are number you can see okay let me check for you if I use e I use e you can see it is zero so in this column there is no any number in here and also if you use d it is not a number so if I use e you can see as a D also zero if I use G column G if you count you can see here the number here so the total number of cells is 18. If I delete one, for example, it will become 17. For example, you can see. Any blank or other text is not count. It's count only the number here. So as the moment we have like some blank. So it will reduce. It just count the number. So it is the definition of the formula account okay I undo okay how about count if count is we have the definition as here to count a number of that that meet a criteria okay we can say just criteria Okay. So we can define only one condition when one criteria in here. For example, I use count if I select like a rank, this is a rank like F, F, and I select here is the condition. You can see the criteria. We can set only one criteria. Current criteria is a condition what we want to find. I set the value is like smaller than 100 
as you can see, what is the number smaller than 100? It is 7 number, as you can see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, you can see. If we have a lot of number, and those number have different value, so we can set the condition here. So, it is the formula of count if, so we cannot set any other criteria. So it is the limitation of count if. So let's go back to count if with s. You can see in here, let's I mean that uh, what is the difference between count if and count if with s. Okay. For example, in here, this formula I set two criteria. Okay, the formula we can say that criteria rank one isolate D is one is criteria one as like John. You can join. We also can input the word John in here, but I just select the cell which has the word John here, such as like here. And this is the criteria 2. I mean the rank 2 and criteria 2. This is the rank 2. Okay, I said in here. And I set the criteria, I mean the condition for the criteria 2. So you can see. Bigger or equal 100. So it had two criteria 1. It checked only person has the, uh, the word John, mean person name is John, and the value in Jen, mean the value in Jen, sorry, the value in Jen is bigger or equal 100. So how many cell that meet this criteria? You can see in here. So the total is 2. So I highlight 1, 2, 3. This belong to John. But the value bigger or equal than 100 only 2. You can see. This number equal and bigger than 100. So if I change this 1 to example 98. So this value will be changed to number one because I change this number under I mean below to 100. Okay, let me press enter. You can see in here. So we can set more condition. So it count the value in here like any value that up like bigger than 100 so this one if I change this one back you can see like 100 101 suppose like that it will become number 2 so it comes from here and here so this one is not count because it is under 100 so if I put 100 This is total is 3. So, count, count if, count if with S, we used to count. But, it's a bit different as you see. It, we can say it's similar to, like, uh, sum, sum if, and sum if with S, sum. The formula, like, uh, to sum, the data. This formula means count to count the number of cells. So it is the different are using count. Okay, I hope that you understand about that. Whenever we want to use count or count if or count if with s, sorry, count if with s. So uh, 
we can use any layer formula that meet our requirement with our condition so if we want to set more than two I, 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 I can say that more than one criteria is it is necessary to use this formula so we can see this formula we also can just use one uh, criteria in here if we understand i think we should choose this one it's a bit uh, like complicated than other but it is had some condition we can use it is more powerful than this two but this one is just it like easy one and also uh, a bit more difficult but it's not quite difficult and this one also not quite but it has some more condition and we can, we can uh, set only one condition for the formula also so I think uh, I just want to show you yeah I can say just want to show you how to use that and any like uh, requirement you can use for your job Thank you for watching. I will try to show what are the different of each formula. And yeah, in in each we have some formula. It's different, just a little bit different. But sometimes we don't know what are the different. So just try to show or you by then. Okay. Thank you. If we want, if you want to know any other formula, what are the different, you can comment on me. Which also I will try to show you how how it works and what are the different. I'll just. Think the formula. Thank you for your watching. Bye bye.